We are disappointed, however, by their ongoing shameful and reprehensible attacks on Ms. Spears and others. And we're looking forward to continuing our vigorous investigation into the conduct of Mr. Spears over the last 13 years while he reaped millions of dollars. Okay, breaking news, everybody. Okay, what is it? What? Jamie Spears has agreed. It's time to step down as conservator of Britney's Whoa! estate. He just said so in new legal docs. Wow, Lori, that's a big deal. Uh, uh, but the legal docs, here's what is Jamie's lawyer saying. Okay. There are, in fact, no actual grounds for suspending or removing Mr. Spears as a conservator of the state and is highly debatable whether a change in conservator at this time would be in Ms. Spears' best interest. Now, here's where the boom gets lowered. Nevertheless, even as Mr. Spears is the unremitting target of unjustified attacks, he does not believe a public battle with his daughter over his continuing service. Mind you, he's getting paid right, quite a bit of money right, right, right. as her conservator would be in her best interest. So even though he must contest this unjustified petition for his removal, Mr. Spears intends to work with the court and his daughter's new attorney to prepare for an orderly transition wow. to a new conservator. Regardless of his formal title, Mr. Spears will always be Miss Spears' father. He will love her unconditionally and always <laughs> look up for her best interest. And then he goes on to attack his ex-wife, Lynn, saying she had little, if any, involvement in the conservatorship, let alone even in Brittany's life for the last 13, 13 years. He says her credibility is undermined because Brittany herself refused to even see Lynn when she was at a mental health facility in 2019 which he put her there under false pretenses. If you're to believe everything right. that her her so person he wants to lash out at his ex wife. Yes, he's stepping back, but not because he did anything wrong. Well, and then I want you to know my ex wife did was suck too. Basically. Yes, that's basically what he says. <laughs> yeah, and then he says that he saved. He essentially saved Brittany when she's in crisis, desperately in need of help. Thirteen years ago, not only was she suffering mentally and emotionally, she was being manipulated by predators and in financial distress. And he came to his daughter's rescue to protect her. And I think he did do that, but he is kind of a hillbilly, right? Not a super educated man, and for whatever reason. He went along with my daughter should be in a full blown conservatorship right. for the rest of her life at the age of 27. Uh, maybe he didn't even read the paper. Do you know what I yes, mean? Yes, he yes, did yes. her dirty unintentionally, maybe, but maybe. then it started. But then it just kept going. And yeah. Because I know my parents would have, like, said, you know, if you're, if one of their kids were going through a hard time, they wouldn't want to have us, like, our life locked away forever. No, no of course not. Because you have a chance to get well and right. find out what's going on. He says he never forced her to do anything, including performing. He's really saying a lot. And uh, TMZ contacted Brittany's lawyer. He said, we are pleased, but not necessarily surprised that Mr. Spears and his lawyer finally recognize he must be removed. We are disappointed, however, by their ongoing shameful and reprehensible attacks on Ms. Spears and others. And we're looking forward to continuing our vigorous investigation into the conduct of Mr. Spears over the last 13 years while he reaped millions of dollars. Right. And I look forward to taking, this is her to lawyer, to taking Mr. Spears' sworn deposition in the near future. He's in going the, after him. In well, the, she wanted, she said, I want to sue. Or in the interim, let me finish yep, the I'm lawyer sorry. statement. Okay. In the interim, rather than making false accusations and taking cheap shots at his own daughter, we're glad Mr. Spears has stepped aside immediately. The bottom line is he, he knows there's forensic accounting coming. Yep. And he's going to get busted. Something. Yep. Something. Yep. And if nothing else, the fact that he was... You know, not, I mean, giving her, making all that money and giving her less money than sure, he got. Sure, sure. 
You know, 100% he, right. he paid himself way too right. much money, <laughs> a lot of money. A lot and of her money. allowance was very tiny. I mean, I would be, I would be really, I would hate that too. I, mean, I would too. Yeah. That's not good. And then, um, so he knows that something is coming because yesterday, one of Britney's dancers from the circus, uh, starring Britney Spears in 2009. And you saw this saw tour. That one. This, saw was, this was her tour. This was her tour, but it was not the first time I saw her. It was the second time I saw Where her. you said she was out of it. She seemed out of it. And anyway, her dancer, Valerie Moyes, um, was on that worldwide tour. Yeah. And yesterday she took to Instagram to share a story with Britney, admitting that one time she was forced to perform at a venue where she said, I remember crying backstage when Miss B did not want to go back out because there was so much weed smoke in the audience. And she said they dragged her by her arms back to the stage anyway. She didn't want to perform because if the conservatorship caught drugs in her system, she was worried they would take away her kids. Oh, my word. Wow. Fans have wow. since dug up the performance clip where Spears is seen not performing choreography at the end of her song Radar in Vancouver 2009. Afterward, th the show was stopped and an announcer took to the speaker to let the audience know it was a non-smoking venue. And then Brittany made reference to the weed at the very end of the concert. Yeah. Saying drive safe, don't smoke weed and rock out with your bleeps out. Peace, mother bleepers. That's what Brittany said to everybody. But <laughs> yes. she took she left the stage. So, you know, that was another thing that that came um out, just you know, other stories. So I think Jamie Spears knows that there's a lot of uh stuff that's going on that um is not gonna look good for him. Absolutely. And right. that's why he's stepping aside. Yeah. Yeah. I would agree. No doubt yep. about it. I agree. No doubt about it. I so, agree. and I hope, Brittany, I hope, uh, you know, that this is the absolutely right thing that, you know, that she's doing and it's, it all works out for her. I feel know? like it's going to. I do too. I feel real hopeful about yeah. it. I do. I do. I think it's good. Thank you.